So a few days ago on my Facebook page, I posted uh, from a client of mine, uh, Katrina Kenny. She won an award in Ireland uh, for a peace gospel. Uh, she sent it to me to listen to before she did it, and I listened to it, and it sounded gospel-y. And my only thing was, I said to her, you know, why didn't you find somebody that at least sounded black? And she said, this woman is the most black-sounding woman I could do. I knew. and uh, But I want to give you kind of a brief description. Uh, I've been working with Katrina for seven or eight years. Her uh, hairdresser came to some seminars. He came to a preview and uh, really uh, went on the attack. And I said, you know, I really don't want him in a class. And we had 12 people. He was the 13th. I said, you can't come. And he said, I'm coming. I have canceled all my clients for Saturday. I've never done that before. And he came to the class. And then a few months later, Katrina came. And we've been working together. She's done month longs with me. Uh, when we met, she was a PA. That's a personal assistant. And among other things, uh, had written a book. She's extremely talented, a photographer, a musician, uh, a uh, author, obviously. She gave her a manuscript, and I started reading it, and I, I didn't finish it. I, I, I don't know why. But uh, she came, her mom was dying, and a nurse who was working really closely with her in Ireland said, you know, you need to get out of here for a while. And she told her why, and Katrina I was doing a self-actualization here at the end of a month long, and Katrina showed up, and we were interviewing her, and I said to my wife, oh, I said, do you want to uh, co-train with me? And she said, I said, just see what I do. It had been a while since she'd watched a class or been in a class, or I said, just watch what I do and, and see whether you still like it or not. And, and uh, at one point, when we were interviewing Katrina, I said, you know, wow, I said, it's interesting. And I said, you don't have a dream right now. And my wife, who was co-training, said, come on, this is Katrina. Uh, She's an author, she's a musician, she's a photographer. She's got all these things going for her. I said, but look around her. Look around her. There is no dream right now. I said, who's taking the dream away? And because, uh, as I've said before, I believe that people can take your happiness away. And if you're not ruthless for your own happiness, you're going to lose it. If you blame them for taking your own happiness, well, you're stupid. But get them out of your lives and get back to your own happiness. Make life really simple. That's what it's here for. But uh, she answered the question when I said, who took away your happiness, with one of the most absurd answers, somebody who she'd been a roommate with, and it was just a, merely a bitch fight she was having. And I said, no, 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 it's not that person. I said, I, I guarantee it. And how do I know these things? I don't know how I know these things, but I was sure about it. Uh, we took a break, and she came up to me, and she said, you know, uh, the nurse who told me to get away for a while, told me to get away because where my mother is in her life, as she's dying, she will take away all my dreams. She said she'll take away everything she can right now. She's just in a real desperate state of life. And she said, basically, that's why I'm here. She said, I can't believe that I didn't know that answer when I was in there. And, but uh, just to, you know, that's that's who Katrina is. She's done month loans with me, like I said. Uh, she, When she was a PA, a personal assistant, uh, she was in and out of the hospital at least twice a year with uh, IBS, irritable bowel syndrome, and uh, that pretty much magically stopped being a phenomena in her life because uh, she got out of a, a lot of stress. She quit doing a job that she thought she had to do. She started doing things that were more fun for her, her photography, her music, all of these things, and a lot of her, oh my God, physical symptoms disappeared. Uh, and she's, okay, looking to get pregnant now. So if there's anybody else listening to the video that uh, is curious about that, uh, contact her. It's on Facebook. You probably be fairly easy to do that. But uh, have a fun day. Have a great day. Uh, www.micpeakperformance.com. That's my website.